this place brings back the worst memories. It's like being kidnapped all over again. Yeah, by this place, he is referring to the giant squid pit we just jumped into. You know, carefree, not a concern in the world, just straight to the bottom of squid hell. No longer a background murmur, the presence in your mind builds to a roar. We've found it. The absolute is and I behind this door. could have sworn that I saved somewhere differently, but maybe I forgot to save. I didn't free the devil Mizora sent Will for. If you walk through, yeah, we door, actually did do that last door. time. And his soul will be Mizora's eternally. But I just don't want to do that this time. So we're gonna go, because you know we worked out their thing, and then she kind of just backstabbed us a little bit you said it was under control it isn't you i answer to gortash i assume oh, i was probably supposed to voice. meet all these people before Is i got here absolute? especially Sleep, her yes with cleavers through his blood starved flesh how it crawls with failure like flies on oh i like her carrion. You forget yourself, Orin. I have played my like part. Like a lobster crab you person. Army for our masters, true enough. But what of the astral prison? A rogue, true soul, flaunting it under your nose all this time, and you ran from him. Sure that they would follow and deliver it into my hands. <laughs> he was right. We're, if you would we are here right now. We are very here. The distractions have been yours, Ketherick. Perhaps we never should have dug your daughter up. So you haven't lost your edge. I think his daughter Just we might have killed already. Body, I wager. Ooh. I really like her, yeah. His crypt breath sings to my sinews again, 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 again. And he's mortal now because we fucked up his whole immortality he plan. Must lead the murder march to Baldur's grave. <sighs> if the weapon is truly in your grasp, Ketherick. Might I suggest closing your fist? Orin and I can wait for you no longer. The plan proceeds. We're going to the city and we expect you to follow. Army this is still like the B tier bad guys we haven't met. The actual villains yet, it seems. The Lash of Ball. Oh, they've got some serious squid magic on their side, I think. That might be the bad guy. No, they're controlling it. That looks like a boss fight to me, though. The Testament of Merkel. Oh, so we need to steal these gems. An elder brain. One of the cruelest and most powerful creatures in existence. Enslaved by mere mortals. There we are. It wouldn't do to fight in front of our guest. Behold, Duke Ravenguard, the absolute. Helm preserve us. You wag your I'm words so confused. in vain, Alderling. Once the worm holds the whip, your shredded flesh will serve us. Oh, not the tadpole. It's not pleasant. It was never pleasant to begin with. Now, it's really time we were going. We will empty this place and begin the march. You may catch up with the army once you've retrieved the weapon. And Ketherick, do try not to sulk. You're supposed to be the fearsome general come to conquer the city, and I am the hero who will save it. Oh, they're playing both sides of the coins here. It is time, faithful oh. ones. March on Boulder's Gate. How is the skeleton controlled by a mind flayer if it doesn't have a brain? <laughs> I feel like we did not do the appropriate side quests to get ready for this. Should get turned into a squid? burns red hot, then goes hollow. A presence disappears from your mind. You failed to fulfill Mizora's mission. She was Zariel's asset you were meant to rescue. And the Absolute's cult has destroyed her. 
Will has failed his patron, and the Hells have taken the Blade of Frontiers as their own. That, that, that's fine, we never really used Will anyway. Oh, he's still here. And he's healed. God's I probably would have liked Will a little bit more if he was the most hypocritical motherfucker in existence. There you are, as predicted. What is it, I wonder, that draws one toward death like a moth to light? You could have run away, absconded with the prism. The one thing that could prevent me from fulfilling my destiny. Once we fell down the squid hole, the this is kind of the only of way we could go. Is irresistible, isn't it? Perhaps you hope to learn your place in history before you are erased from it. A bright flash of clarity before the snuffing out. He is incredibly cool and I want to recruit him, but I feel like it's either impossible or incredibly difficult. What is the deal with the prism? The very fact of your being attests to its power. Despite your infection, you resisted the brain here in the heart of its domain. What good is an army of thralls if they do not obey their master? Let us speak plainly. My Lord Merkel gave me the one thing I desired, the one thing no other god could grant me. My daughter's life returned. Her heart. I really hope she's not the one more. we killed now. For that, he asked that I serve as his chosen. Join Orin and Gortash to grow the cult of the Absolute, and then take control of it. He's never had a more devoted follower. I have fought great wars before in the service of other gods and other powers. But for Merkel, I would condemn all of Pharaoh just another walk in the death. park for him. You are all that stands between me and my destiny. And you have brought the prism here. I will kill you now. I feel like he's the and main character. You as my servant. How has he done this to us? Maybe you want to flip on them? Yes. Say farewell, Isabel. I'm grateful to you for bringing me home. I was a fool to resist. He is the person we helped get kidnapped. I know better now. Good luck in the City of Judgment. I wish you the best. Sincerely. No way, is that his daughter? My lord, I offer you these souls so they may return as servants to your cause. Join the army of the dead, true soul. Witness Lord Merkel's glory. But I basically got her kidnapped so that she could actually help us during this fight, and that does not seem to have worked out at all. We finally knock him back and just send him flying down this pit in the middle, maybe. We hit about half our shots there. <laughs> oh, God damn it! I keep forgetting to summon my animal companions. Let me just do it now. Anyway, the boar was really good the last time we used it. Can I just summon him next to them already? Actually, that is... Very useful. I could use that during fights more often. Oh, it's just a normal mind flare. I haven't seen one of those in so long. Oh, fuck. Our boar is just tanking for us. Okay, he did not last very long. Here come the little guys. Oh, I'm so shocked that that connected. Yeah, anytime we land a hit on him, it's kind of a miracle. Oh, we're stunned. So we missed our turn as the Baron. Oh, no, he just flies off. What is he doing? Hoping just to light. Oh, yes, we can light them all on fire. Oh, that's what those things do. They explode into skeletons. There you go. Incredibly, incredibly weak skeletons. Is that you keep doing your thing? You're doing fantastic right now, actually. It's just one miss. That's fine. No, they're all dead. I didn't even realize they died. They just burned to death. Can't summon another companion. The classic that is Hail of Thorns. Oh no, he's back. I did not realize how fucked up the Baron is right now. You try 1v1 this guy. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Could have been so easy, but nope. I really need to give Asterion another weapon because he just cannot use that axe at all. I am fury. I am dead. Might be able to finish him now. Yes, yes. What a fool you are. 
You cannot kill me. I am eternal. I feel like we could just drop a big rock on him, though. Like an anvil. Oh, no, he's going for a second phase. Merkel, Lord of Bones, I am here. I am ready. I am yours. You dare end one who belongs to me. I am the smile of the worm cleansed skull. I am the regrets of those who remain and the restlessness of those who are gone. I am the haunt of mausoleums, the god of graves and age. Gassing himself off with his own WWE style intro. Holy <laughs> Lord of Bones. And you have slain my chosen. But it is no matter, for I am death. And oh god damn. I am not the end. Oh god damn it. Oh god. <laughs> Maybe if the guy was still actually immortal. Shit. <laughs> yeah, shit. This wouldn't be a problem. Holy fuck. He's just an apostle. How the hell are we supposed to win this fight? Let's just try to shoot him. That goddamn thing. It looks like a Yu-Gi-Oh monster. I'm hoping because he's a big creature we can get more hits on him with. What the f- what, what's it happened? Why did Hail of Thorns hit everybody here instead of... This is going to be such an infuriating fight, actually. Oh, God. Please don't tell me he can move. Oh, Jesus. I really need you to drop some heals right now. Get, like, at least one attack off that connects. There we go. Maybe I wasn't taking this fight as seriously as I should have in the beginning. What happens if we trip this thing? <laughs> and no, we cannot afford to miss right now. And we do not have any health potions. Okay, can we please try and launch a hail of thorns properly here? It doesn't matter how big the thing is. Whoa! This has gone and sucked everybody right up into him, but this might actually work in our favor since... That heart's only good attack works up close and personal, and that didn't really do much either. So just heal yourself. No, why did I waste that attack? I thought I was going to walk. Oh, Jesus. Do not want him to swing that scythe at us, actually. Provokes an attack of opportunity, even though we are very well within his attack range anyway. We only have regular. <laughs> no, no, we're missing all our shots. We do not have something for this. We... Yes, we might have something for this. Calling in some backup. God damn it. The backup is out of range. I'm pretty sure he said that would work anywhere. Let me just throw a random anti ethyl potion at this guy. Do anything? <laughs> just hit him and not open. Oh, we got another miss. Should have done sacred munitions to begin with on this skeleton guy. Oh. Okay, now that didn't kill anybody. It just looked like it was incredibly, incredibly painful. Oh, that's another miss. Are those skeletons sacrificing themselves to the big skeleton guy? I've got him down to about half health. Why did we just climb up? Okay, so that's everybody who was standing up there down. He's birthing more and more skeletons. Okay, we really should have placed Asterion with Karlak for this. Fight. It's never too late. Oh, one health left. Come on. Okay, no. What the hell does Reaper's Reward do? Okay, Asterion. It's 1v1, the big skeleton guy. And swing and a miss. Okay, let's load that up. Oh, that's so annoying that we have to go through the first one. All we have to do is kill that guy. Oh, we can't change anybody out. I don't think this has cast all harm buff spells. Summon our creature first. And then Asterion, you can just get into sneak mode. Yeah, let me change his weapon. Or at least give him a 
Use two crossbows. Why isn't he using both? Wait, no, he doesn't have two. Everybody, some good berries. It's better than nothing. Alright, this time. Maybe that spell would actually be helpful. <laughs> right, this is a big undead fight. I need to use more of our spells. Okay, yeah, we know the drill. We leave Mizora, and in we go. Yeah, that was Will's deal. He got himself into that mess. I'm sure I'll be fine. I think the fight has the start idea. What if we were to just attack him? What the f Okay, we just had the Zell attack Asterion for some reason. Start this fight off with a sneak attack, maybe. Does he not have his bloody bow equipped? Unless yeah, Lazel knocked it out of his hand. We've had better starts to fights, okay? Sneak attack range. I guess we can just regular attack him. He gets a little closer. Pew! <laughs> he doesn't get his Big speech just because we attacked him first. Honestly, didn't want to hear again anyway. Let's hit him with the disarming attack. Nope, that's just a miss. There we go, weapon dropped. Action surge that. Pushing attack, he's right next to the hole. Even though, yeah, it just doesn't push. Ah, oh, no, that's... Yeah, that sucks, we can't attack. Because we already attacked. I guess that makes sense. He was a surprising amount of trouble the first time. Uh, okay, Shot of Heart, Spirit, Guardian. Re this is the big unit of a thing, right? Really do much. Ah, okay, no, he takes damage for being near us. I can live with that. But he dropped his weapon. <laughs> Let's just firebomb them all. There's a path interrupted. Yeet. Why does he take zero damage from that? Let's try and turn undead. Didn't do anything. Okay, Lazelle has just not been getting any attacks because she was stunned for so long. Oh, she's just missing everything. Oh, there we go. Good stage. Uh, Arrow of Darkness. Blinded. Okay. Getting her kidnapped was a terrible idea. Anti-magic arrow on the magic person might be worth using. Critical miss. A regular miss. Oh, what is with all these misses? Oh, he dropped his weapon. Doesn't mean we can pick that big, massive scythe up by any chance, does it? Hysterion can get down safely because we blinded the thing. That's working out very well so far. Other arrows. We have arrow of ice. That must be construct. Is that not a construct? Sure as how it looks like he's constructed out of bones. Is he still blinded? Yeah. Shadow Heart, keep healing. He doesn't actually know we're right there. I guess we're 1v1ing this thing. He does miss. I'm wasting all my good arrows on this, but I don't care. Seems to be doing the trick. Oh, that's a miss. Oh, I think he can see again. Oh, he can see again. So I'll just keep giving him the business. Oh, they're getting messed up very badly. Uh, darkness arrow? Yes. No. Crap. Darkness arrow? Yes. Please work. Okay, good, good, good. Critical hit. We're getting there. Shadow Heart, you just heal Lazelle, okay? Doing a damn terrible job of it as well. Where it might clutch us the win here. Oh, anyway, wait, Shadow Heart, if you get closer, will you just start doing damage to him with your little aura effect thing? Just shoot myself. Get a little closer. No, it doesn't do anything. Alright, you can fight here. One health left. Unless there's a third phase of this boss fight. Critical miss. <laughs> oh, that's Lazelle down. I still think we'd be fine to deal with the skeletons once this, this thing is down, yeah. Oh, thank god. Oh, look who's back. He's all fucked up looking now. Oh, I'm gonna loot his armor as soon as he's dead. Forsaken. I should take that gem. It's exploding out the mouth and nose. Pick up Lazelle. We'll go loot him and then we'll go loot his dead daughter as well. This sort of looks like a crystal from Crash Bandicoot. Oh no! We're not asleep right now, right? What the hell was the skeleton thing? She says that like it's very significant and we should know what it means. It's about that cure. I thought she was the reason for the abnormality. This feels like she's just making it up as she's going along. Oh, uh, what now? Why does this feel like a completely different story just stacked on top of the already established story? Oh, hell yeah. Let's give 
Lazelle his Warhammer, actually. I feel like she can put it to better use in the Baron. No, but I love you from IZ. I'm gonna give her the arm too, though, yeah. You Lazelle can have that. It's pretty damn good. Yeah, her stuff isn't really as good, but I'll take it all anyway. Oh, that's convenient. Portal out. Is there no other loot in here? Guess not. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on, we should probably read. Whatever this is, this is probably very important. Grand design. The mind player species wide ambition to return to their days of conquering. Oh, an act of sudden mass seramorphosis. Okay, that's exactly what's happening right now, yeah. Invasion plans. Extend to North Arm, including several archaeologists. Okay. Can't even take it, which is odd. I feel like we're going to be in a situation where we can get somebody's help and they're going to want proof, except we're not going to have proof because we can't take any of this with us. Portal it is. The hell where are we? Oh, wasn't I supposed to bring her with me to kill him? Like Seems cool with it though. Brain, bound by lost Netherese magic, with servants of the dead three holding the chain. <laughs> Reminds me of old times. That is exactly why she's one of my favorites. <laughs> she's seen it all before. More than anyone should. But I never dreamed I'd see the dead three working in consort with the Lithids. It is most disturbing. But take courage. We have killed a man who could not die. And stripped the Absolute's army of its general. You have a netherstone. And you're on the scent of two more. These chosen have reason to fear you and... I would like to be at your side when you confront them. Okay, she's finally coming with us. Probably a good thing that she wasn't with us because then the person we got kidnapped probably would have let her know that we helped her kidnap that person. Thus instigating the demise of her, like, whole team. Of course. Falling foul of Catherick convinced me that's my... We ventured in... When we reach Baldur's Gate, there will be even so you're amply reinforced me. already. With the absolute, there's a Harper's safe house in. Beyond that, okay, so she's not joining me yet, and he's here too. The shadows yet fester. The dead three united under cover of darkness. The balance. Shifts. He's just kind of here. There are depths to this alliance yet unplumbed. Consider, mortal. Do illithids possess souls? Met that one cool guy. Yeah, yeah, who are you? There are many answers to those questions. None are important. Arm is not as cool as the star. I shall ask again. Do illithids possess so Yeah. No. Nor canst thou count mind flares among them. Yet. The three amass an illithid army void of apostolic souls that could imbue them with power. We have a stone in a his mouth. A flock without souls. Yet to what end, mortal? This is the question thou must come to answer. Until such time, be availed of my services. Yeah, how do you know yes, about the Bane, dead three? Lord of Darkness, Baal, Lord of Murder, Merkel, Lord of Bones. Once judged, ascended, then vanquished as one and as three. The Alliance is reforged, mortal. The planes thus quake, and the gods shudder. It's never very helpful. Back to camp? Yes, back to camp, okay. Karlak and Gale are still here. Whale is gone, I think. <laughs> oh, shit. 
Well, got turned into a pile of ash. I mean, let's loot all this stuff. Pick up his pile of ash. Yeah, we can. And that counts as his whole body anyway. 75 kilos. Let's just drop that. I think I've just been ignoring most of the plot lines related to demon nonsense. And we're back. No way. I thought he disappeared every time we did a rap. Okay, let's continue. I assume we're supposed to be going to Baldur's Gate, even though I have no idea where that is. Okay, we can head that way. Oh, yeah, I forgot how many people we killed on the way in here. How many more allies do we need? We got one, and we lost one, so... Side quest time. Gotta recruit some folk. And who wouldn't want to join up with this ragtag band of adventurers we've got right here? The option seems to be either that or get turned into a squid person. We had explored everywhere here, but I guess not. They kind of overhyped the Shadowlands a little bit. The Shadowlands weren't that bad. Look, this is exit. Yeah, to Baldur's Gate. This is probably going to be one of those finish up your business now. Yeah. Mind and, well, in a quick word. Stereo I talk. F. Or is it an E? Is it even a letter? What damn language is this? Just because of the evil book. What are you doing? What are you doing? I was minding my own business. If only everyone was so considerate. Listen, we travel together, but we're not friends. I'm not about to share anything with someone I can't trust. Look past the bluster. That's a surprisingly tricky one. He's got a lot of bluster. There we go. He might be sneering, but you can see pain in his eyes. He needs help, but doesn't know how <clears throat> to ask. It's okay, buddy. I... We all need help. This isn't your problem. <laughs> Shut up and turn around. The pattern swirls before you, runes hacked crudely into his flesh. You can't read it, but you recognize the letters. Infernal, the language of the hells. And? What does it say? I have no idea. Infernal? Are you sure? Can you show me? Yeah, I guess they haven't really got mirrors in whatever time period this is supposed to be. What in the hell? What did he do to me? You just woke up all of a sudden one day with this. I have absolutely no idea, but it's no poem. Two centuries carrying this, and I can finally see. How has he gone 200 years? These vampires can't see themselves I'm in mirrors, sure. actually. But what will it say? Th thank you, by the way. This is, well, it's some. Don't even worry about it, buddy. Matter. I probably won't. I think we need to go through Shadowheart's absolutely monstrous amount of dialogue. I've actually done it. I'm a lady even wants all that. There is one other matter. As the chosen of Lady Shah, I s leave it to me. You'll see exactly what I mean soon. Any of these that important? Yeah, the artifact. Uh, I felt it. So it likes us more than her now. Yes. No. I don't know. The artifact seems to have powers and a will of its own. It protects us. I don't know how or why, but I'm glad. I felt it go from me to you. You need its help just as it needs us. It's still just a box after all. We get to keep it or... It might not be possible. It's stubborn that way. Prone to... Nice, we get to keep it. <laughs> Will's pile of ashes is going to get transported with us anytime we go to a campsite. We can't revive him, can we? <sighs> no, he is very, very dead. Scratch wants to talk. The dog wags his tail. What is it, boy? What is it? Clenched between his teeth. What do you got? What do you got? Give me that. Oh, if you gave it to us, we'd have to animal handle him for it. He gives in and surrenders his find to you. <laughs> You've taken a whole salami out of the camp supplies. Scratch his tongue, lolls oh, out okay. happily. Okay. 
so now we can continue. Rick is defeated. The path ahead clear. You should be elated. But the sight of the land you leave behind does nothing to alleviate your sorrow. There's no way this is like right next to Baldur's Gate, right? Isn't Baldur's Gate the place to be and then this is just cursed darkness, shadowland, ruins? Sergeant. If you are here, I presume Worms Rock is secure, and preparations for my inauguration are complete. No, Lord Gortash. We were interrupted. He's Another straddling the, the line between being a goofy More villain time. and being so a cool villain. To my chambers. I'm flattered, Sergeant. Yeah, he goofy. He's goofy as hell. Natural phenomena to cease. Forgive me, my lord, but there is panic in the streets. The people are afraid. Perhaps the people would be calm if you kept your nerve. I expect better from the flaming fist than to run scared from a slight tremor in the earth. Get back to your duties. Duties, duties, duties. Patrolling and saluting and following and bowing and scraping. Yes, sir. No, sir. Rip and cut your throat, sir. <laughs> oh, it's the other person. Your plan is falling apart, Lordling. Give me a reason not to cut you to ribbons. Control yourself, Orin. We need to focus on reuniting the stones or the brain will break free. These quakes are just the start. <laughs> Painters like, I'm going to get hell out of here. Prison super crazy. They'll be traveling to the city. Let's make sure we give them a Baldurian welcome. I itch to peel you. To split your skin, to see your skull shine in the light, <laughs> little tyrant. <sighs> Just left a you, stone there. I harvested a whole family of living flesh in Rivington at High Sun. They will sate my blade thirst tonight. Oh, but tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow, my blades will thirst again. So we need to make sure she doesn't just backstab us as soon as we reach the city. Beyond yeah, the campsite, like we're pretty the much city there. in uneasy silence. One sleep. Leave here, or gonna follow everybody else. Okay, we just need to sleep on it. The events of the last days weigh heavily upon you. Sleep's rest is slow to come to one whose mind is so full. The Absolute is not a god, but an elder brain controlled by the Chosen of the Dead Three. That was a big twist, yeah. ...to take control of the Sword Coast. All who carry the Tadpole are governed by the brain and by extension the Chosen. It will take but one order to transform them into an army of Mind Flayers. This would have been your fate, too, were it not for the Dream Visitor's protection. With her help, you have uncovered the cult for what it really is. A plan of conquest orchestrated by the gods of death themselves. Together, and it was Scooby-Doo villain reveal there the towards the end. If you follow this path to its end, the Elder Brain will not answer to the Chosen. It will answer to you. Uh, and we when get to decide what happens. From their parasites and their religious delusions. Or will you use the power you gain for your own purposes? Oh, we're absolutely going to use the power we gain for our own purposes. Don't be silly. I'll do what feels you right. Don't have long to wait. All you need to do now is sleep. But sleep is not for you. Downing is upon us. Oh, the, the dice. It's trying to help or it's trying to get away. Oh no. We're under attack. Help me. Escape to the portal before the absolute takes control, huh? This portal. Oh, we only have three turns. Probably don't have time to be messing around here. Gotta move everybody towards the exit. Oh, hang on, okay. That guy's got some serious knockback. Surge. Oh, yes. Oh, a double miss. Jesus. We still have three turns. I think we'll be fine unless they get more back up. Are we missing? Oh, Asterion is just face down on the ground. Okay, two turns. That's not great, actually. 
Oh, and yeah, they have more back up. Uh, let's just try to dash our way out of this one. Jump, keep going. There we go, Lizelle's through. Okay, they pull everybody. Uh, we're in space now. Oh, chest. We go back through the portal. Yeah. Now we don't have the timer thing. Everybody's like super spread out again. Let's just leave. No, damn it. <laughs> Use the portal. We can't use the portal anymore. <laughs> it's only one time thing. We messed that up, didn't we? All these kung fu guys after us. Where's our last save? Oh yeah, that's fine. We'll just rush straight for it again. Zero point in fighting those people. Okay, go to sleep. Skip all this again. Okay, let's just leave. Oh, so close, can't reach it. Unless... The action surge, yeah, then. If it gets out of here, right? Oh, no, that doesn't count for movement. Dash. Oh, it does. Okay, good. We're out. Let's just get that chest real quick. This unhappy little guy. Oh! Wait, hang on. Right there on our side. It's all the Kung Fu Gith Yankee. Oh. Okay, I thought they were going to actually be helpful, but no. We should just scorched a bunch of them. Yeah, I thought. Leza would be able to talk with these people, but I guess it's no different to people fighting people. Git fighting Git, and they're even more incredibly violent than most people are. Big jump. We land on top of this person? Yeah, not really. Oh, that was a bad one. Let me just summon up a couple of good berries. Yeah, the unarmed fighters don't have anything we can loot. That looks pretty fucking sick. Seems to be where we need to go. Oh, bloody hell. Is... Yeah, everybody is split up now. For whatever reason. Anytime we need to navigate by jumping, this happens. I've barely used enhanced sleep, so let's see what we can change that with. Uh, that seems pretty good. I'm absolutely not making any kind of decent build, as far as I know. We're just going with whatever sounds good. We can get magic missile now. Ah, we'll go for clouded daggers though. That's messed me up a few times. Hearts picture change. Oh, that's a fat jump. We. Woo. Oh, they got the little guys. Whose side am I on again? That was pretty cool. Okay, I quite like the Kung Fu Gith Yankee. Before you do anything, I am your ally. Bet he says that to a we lot of people. Are in danger. Geek abomination by the one true sky. What is this madness? Gith Yankee is the source of our protection against the absolute. I must subdue him. Or everything we've worked towards is lost. Does that make sense? Don't let my form deceive you. I am the one that's been protecting you. I am the one that came to you in your dreams. I knew that was a squid trick. Help I knew it was me. squid nonsense the entire time. It's not that I don't believe him because he's a mind player, it's just that, you know, I don't really believe him because he's been deceiving us this whole time. Okay, prove to you me anything you said is true. Viper. Back in the Druid's Grove, you killed the Azuma Night Song. You didn't have to. I don't even know. Your I don't even remember if I did that. Existence Maybe. Is yourself, and not a mind flayer should be all the proof you need. Now... Help me. Hmm. Detect thoughts. I'm gonna need a little bit more than that, Chi. Here we go. Despite your best attempts to be subtle, the mind flare's awareness is everywhere. You blunder in its presence like a warg pup learning to walk. You must be joking. I am telling you my thoughts directly <laughs> He's got a point. into your head. But if you insist on taking a look for yourself, 
be my guest. You're telepathically communicating right now. Nothing in your colorful existence to date could have prepared you for this. As the horror subsides, you are left with only one coherent thought. You <laughs> so, okay, we should do that. That's definitely a good idea. Happy? Now, join me. Just don't show Fight. me any more of whatever you just showed me. Aid an illicit against Githyanki. We cannot. We must not. Your blind loyalty will be your undoing, Lazel. Fight with me for your own survival. Together, we can turn the tide. Okay, so we're going after the Githyanki now. The little brains are on our side, and there's one, two, three, four. Only four of those. Why is he having so much trouble with four Githyanki punchy boys? Oh, does have a lot of health. A tripping attack. Yeah, that was supposed to be a tripping melee attack. Oh, not the intellect of ours. Oh, okay. I almost attacked the squid. Do not attack the squid. Bad habit. Not all the squids are bad. Why are you so messed up? He definitely changed her picture. Whoa, that was a big jump. Can we jump that far? There we go. Trip that person. They're gonna be instantly back on their feet. You just look after yourself. Far can bear jump. Pretty far. How are they doing unarmed range damage? That person's back up. No! Double critical hit. It's one down. Oh, he knocked bear down. I'm kind of liking the martial arts. Ooh. Because it seems like they get a lot of rolls. It's not expecting like four Githyanki to be this much. Oh, he healed a bunch of us. Nice. Oh, of course, Shadowheart missed. Typical. I swear to God, Bear is like the most balanced character in our party. I really wish I was playing as a monk now. Double miss. He gets so many attacks. Okay, fight's over. What's his deal? Yeah. Thank you. That was too close. Don't look at me like that. I am a mind flayer. Yes. Without me, you would be a slave to the So we met a cool squid person before. I'm cool with the squid people. To owe my life to a damned geek. No more lies. No more tricks. I will have answers. But I agree with Lazel. I did always suspect you were a mind slayer. Mind flayer. Why the deception? Necessary. Rare are those that would openly consider a partnership with a Mind Flayer. Even those who are on a path of becoming one. It's like I said before, I'm just like you. An adventurer, I came from Baldur's Gate, though I was never one to be constrained by circumstance. I longed for more. That longing brought me to Moonrise Towers on a search for treasure. To a colony of mind flayers who caught me, changed me into what I am for years. I served the Elder Brain, the one you know as the Absolute. I was a thrall like any other, but I was fortunate. I broke free and started a new life built in different. my own city. I sustained myself on criminals, unglamorous, but there are plenty of them. Rarely missed. And he's also kind of Batman as well. I did my work. I had the good fortune to meet Duke Stelmane. We formed a partnership, and through her, I became the governing force behind the Knights of the Shield, the largest mercantile operation in Baldur's Gate. People referred to me as the Emperor. Such was my influence. Though, of course, they had no idea. <laughs> they had no idea he was a squid. My needs were sated. I was happy for a while. Until my true nature was discovered by the tyrant himself, Lord Gortash. That he guy. Me from my home and brought me back to the brain where I became a slave once again. A slave he continued to call the em The name was intended as a slight to remind me of the heights from which I fell but I have grown fond of it it encapsulates well who I've become how many brains have you eaten? who's the Githyanki? Prince Orpheus 
Son of the first leader of the Githyanki. Orpheus? Impossible. He was slain by Shastil Kithrak himself. Quite I don't know who that is. I assure you, his power has been the source of your continued protection against the voice of the Absolute. The power to disrupt hive mind communication. It is the same power that enabled Orpheus' his mother to bring about the fall of the Illithid Empire eons ago. A power she passed on to him, and that I leveraged for you. I kind of feel like he's underutilizing this. Observer took her place. Blacketh declared herself queen of the Githyanki. Blacketh wanted his power, but Orpheus rose against her, and so she sealed him and his honor guard within this prism. Bound by infernal chains, Orpheus could never leave. Bound by duty, his guard never would. Oh, they those were the monk people we just killed. On that prince. And if they had succeeded, we would be lost. I am relieved. You have embraced your potential enough that you could help me eliminate them. Alone, Orpheus will be much easier to control. So many unanswered questions and we don't even have the dialogue options to ask about them. I do not have the privilege of knowing the answer, but the consequences are clear enough. Some Githyanki still revere him in defiance of their teachings. Blacketh was safe as long as they believed him to be dead. But as you can see, he is very much alive. So it's more blackmail material slash leverage we've got now on somebody else. Power that she might one day wish to take from him. If the Githyanki ever find out what she has done, there will be civil war. Oh, that's Blacketh good to know. will be finished. Vlaketh is eternal. My people would not be swayed by this... this false prince. But some of them would. No. Gortash sent me on a mission to retrieve the Astral Prism. I was one of many, but the first to find it. How Gortash or the other Chosen learned of its existence, I do not know. The moment I found it, I felt a change. My free will returning. I followed the feeling inside, and found Orpheus. I realized what the prism was for. Containment. While my body was within the prism's bounds, my mind was free. I could resist the Elder Brain, the Chosen. Better yet, I could plan to overthrow yes, so he is. All I needed to do was subdue Orpheus. One plot twist away from betraying us as well, basically. You. We take the power for ourselves. Could we take it all? There may come a time when that is necessary, but there is no guarantee that his power would survive his passing. The risk. It's never any guarantees in life. The moment his protection that's the only gone, thing that's guaranteed. Coming through to the elder brain, just as I would. We may look different, but to the elder brain, we are already the same. Through. In its the more I talk to this guy, the I more I like him. That. But this is what I am. My original body was destroyed when I transformed. When I first escaped the Elder Brain, I searched for a new vessel. But the longer I inhabited this one, the more it grew on me. I realized that returning to my former self would only impose limitations. Any advantage I could gain by restoring my original appearance. I already had to hand in the form of magic and that humanoid shape you've come to know. As an Alithid, I have far surpassed who I ever was before. You too should embrace this change. Still seems like he's a little bit hooked on the squid propaganda. You know, I'm tempted to become a squid just to see I'm what happens. Pleased to hear that. You will do very well as an Alithid. Why is I've he trying to destroy the hive mind if he's so pro elithid? The next stage of your tadpole's life cycle, while continuing to preserve your independence, the transformation will not be complete. The physical alteration, in particular, will only be partial, but your potential will certainly be amplified. Would you like to do it? Would you like to evolve? Oh, turn into a squid person. <sighs> 
How permanent would this be? Uh, not right Even now, not right now. Words, you feel alert, <laughs> it's so true. You're Very disappointed a little bit. With a lipid potential. How could you be so cruel as to deny yourself what do you want most in the world? I felt that. It's your nature. You cannot fight it. So embrace it. Wait, hang on. We're not gonna choice. It wants to evolve, but it cannot do so alone. It must commune with another. Tech thoughts. The tadpole screams for growth with painful intensity. It has been starved of life, of purpose. It welcomes your probing like a void waiting to be it. filled. If you let it, it will evolve you, just as the Emperor said. Yeah, I think we can keep that in the back pocket. We have to roll not to transform here? What? What is it? Oh, shit. You may resist now, but it's too late. You already embraced the powers the parasite gave you. You leverage them to manipulate, to dominate. To Savaja is no longer your own. You are well on your way to fulfilling your illusion. Yeah, we did use a lot of the squid powers, but you are ready. Maybe we used too many. Through your veins as the tadpole oh Jesus! Awakens. Oh Jesus! As yet the tadpole's essence courses through you. Oh, it's happening, oh, no. <laughs> when it Touches your flesh, glands, organs contract and flood with. How many tentacles are we gonna have? You feel different. You are. When your allies see what you can, but we mustn't lose. You heard the trick. We must not let them reach. Oh, okay, hang on. Don't have any tentacles. Best be on my way. We barely see any downsides to that at all. Is that just in our inventory? <laughs> yeah. Oh, gonna bother another person though. Interesting. Mm -hmm.